everyone, we're going to look at r equals 3 divided by 2 plus 2 cosine of theta and find the eccentricity, identify the conic, give an equation of the directrix, and sketch the conic. So first, let's do the first three parts. So basically, let's look what form we have. We have this form here with a plus. So our denominator has uh, plus e cosine of theta. The only problem is we need a 1 here and we have a 2 here. So let's fix that. We're going to write this as r equals 3 divided by 2 plus 2 cosine of theta. And if we multiply our numerator and our denominator by 1 half, that's going to let me have 3 halves divided by 1 plus cosine of theta. All right, that means there's a 1 here. That means my uh, E equals 1. So we found that eccentricity is 1. That means it's a parabola. Um, 3 halves equals ED. This ED part right here. And with... Um, E equals 1, we're going to get 3 halves. This is going to be 1, so we just get 3 halves equals D. Now what that means is since we have cosine, that um, uh, this is uh, to the right of the focus at the origin. So basically, um, we have T equals absolute value of L is the fixed line directrix in the plane and it equals three halves. Since it's positive, it means it's to the right of the focus at the origin. Um, this should be three halves, sorry. It's to the right. All right, and the vertex is going to be the midpoint between the focus and the directrix. And the focus is at the origin. So let's look at this. All right, so let's plot some points. If I have zero, Cosine of 0 is 1. So that's going to be 3 fourths. So I'm going to let this be 3 fourths right here. All right. Um, I'm going to go ahead and plot my uh, directrix, which is going to be 3 halves. So this is 3 fourths, and this will be 3 halves. And we're just going to go by halves. He says this would be 3 fourths, 3. Um, eighths and so forth. We're just multiplying by two. So this is um, um, three-fourths. X equals three-halves. This point here is going to be uh, zero or three-fourths comma zero. All right, at pi, let me just write this out on the side. At uh, pi divided by 2, we get 0, so that's going to be 3 halves. Um, 3 halves is going to go out 2. 1, 2. So this is 3 halves. And 3 pi divided by 2 is also going to be 3 halves. Because this is going to be 0 here. So at 3 pi divided by 2, we're at 3 halves. That means I'm going out 2. All right. So it's going to open to the right, like this, because our directrix is here. It has to open away from the directrix. So it opens to the right. There's your graph. This is your origin. What else do I need to write? These are your points. For example, you would write this as uh, zero. Um, you would write this as three-fourths comma zero in polar form. Um, uh, also, this is our vertex because it is the midpoint between our directrix and our origin. So it is the midpoint, very clearly. And that's it. Thank you. Have a nice day. Bye-bye.